Hey everyone, welcome back to the COD Geek. Today we're going to talk about something that a lot of people have been complaining about lately. The fact that there is a new Call of Duty released every year. This really needs to stop happening, and today I want to tell you why they should stop the yearly release of COD games. Certain features of many of these games are feeling really underdeveloped. Features like the multiplayer operator system and special ops in Modern Warfare, for example, were just really poorly balanced and didn't feel like the effort was put in to make it the absolute best it could be. There is a price to pay when you sacrifice the details. After all, the devil is in those details. But Activision stopping the cash cow from pumping out more Call of Duty games that are undercooked would be a straight up miracle. This is because the game has reached a level of fame that just because the name Call of Duty is on the game, people are going to buy it regardless of the terrible quality. And to add insult to injury, Activision has four different developers guaranteed to make a game every year. And if the game turns out to be crap, it's not Activision that takes the blame, it's the developer. We've come to realize that Activision doesn't care about the unhappy player though, because A, they already have said player's money, and B, with a new developer next time, that player will likely buy the next game anyway. Another thing, we want some time to soak in the game. It is really hard to be peer pants excited about a game that won't matter in a year or less. I know a lot of people play it quickly just to be done and over with it so that they can simply be ready to buy the next one. It's like we are mindless robots playing right into corporate hypnosis. Buy, play, buy, play, repeat until a new console comes out. Then buy that console, buy the game, play, and repeat until you die. If there was a cooling off period longer than a year between these games, it would allow the developers to, well, develop the game better. A lot of the janky issues in these games are easily solved if they just had more time to do it. It would allow time to research the market into what players liked and disliked and ensure the realistic ability to accommodate that information into the new game. What it is appearing as is that Activision has lost the idea of making a good game that fans want to enjoy. All they seem to want is that big fat paycheck each year that the newest game brings in. We can blatantly see this greed in how they increase the price of game passes or season passes that will double the price of the game just so you can get all the content that is offered. Not only that, but locked behind that price tag of passes are multiplayer maps, zombie chapters, and weapons. How is that fair to the player? What could work is to save the expense of the initial game pass, release the game every other year, and in the off year with no new release, offer the game pass package to keep the game relevant. Boom! Great idea, right? Well, it's what makes sense to a lot of people. Myself included. Activision would still get a yearly revenue, developers get more time to make games better, and the player doesn't feel like their game is a waste of time, space, and energy within the year. The franchise still expands and everyone is happy. Let me know what you think about the yearly release. Do you think it should be more time between games? Let me know your opinions in the comments below. And as always, if you enjoyed the video, give it a like and subscribe so you never miss new content from the COD Geek.